Wow. I was wondering what this place was. That's Emily's tree. This is perfect. You made it. I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker. <laughs> so, what do you think? It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. And now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Uh, Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him decide for himself. All right. You know, seeing you boys together again. <laughs> right then. Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. <laughs> so the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this Place. Right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... We got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission. To heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Yes, this is Catherine. May I ask who's calling? Oh, of course. Put him through. That data does not cross-tabulate with the AI learning project during the last milestone. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator, a carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Wanna see how? This is cool. Please remember that Monday is a holiday and the office will be closed. AKA, bee killer wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not to lose. Oh, oh, nice! productive session. We got great data. Okay, why no? I think I'm getting the hang of this. I knew you'd be good at this. I'm in beesness. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. 
I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. <laughs> Harry, a moment, if you please. Uh, any chance it can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh, yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is the lizard. Dad believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call, but uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. So that was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. The origins of life on Earth remain a mystery. How could organic life forms have arisen from non vital Nice. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. I wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. This would have been crime scene evidence. Wonder how it ended up here. Cool fish. Not just fish, research subjects. Want to feed them? Yeah? Japanese koi fish have well-studied pigmentation variation, which is ideal for our research into enhanced reflectivity. Stacks of intracellular anhydrous guanine crystals. Separated by cytoplasm, we're finding it very useful for eco-friendly roofing materials. Now, I like so science cool. and physics, but they are speaking literal Latin. Like, what the fuck? May would have loved this. Hinoscopic stabilizing gyroskiskers. What the? F did you see the monthly schedule up here? Hey, what are you doing with these bikes? We're working on ultra efficient batteries charged by bicycles. These bikes? Can I ride them? Not right now, but when they're road ready, we'll need people to test them. Nice. I'll try to come back. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. You really have a particle accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but we'll have it back up in no time. Incredible. Where are we heading now? Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Even before high school. Middle school. Okay. 
Now, do you know the... Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gregor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? Yes, that was so great. Interesting research project. And lowers the old cortisol levels, too. Right? I honestly think it's one of my favorite spots in the building. I see what you're saying. The algorithm is similar to long division, uh, if you look at it that way. Got it. Mm -hmm. Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Match the base pairs to incorporate as many growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. Interesting. Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Great. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. So smart. All right, let's just start throwing stuff out there. Let's do this. Let's see. Second, about exactly how it worked. One step closer to feeding the world. <laughs> nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. If I combine these traits... Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wow! I know a rooftop you could use for a real-world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. <laughs> Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry. Now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet, not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in.
man. Harry. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. If you join me, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and me proud, huh? It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> <laughs> One quick thing. <laughs> you know, they say too good to be true. I, I'm, I'm gonna need a little time this is that. to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course, take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Coney Island later, yeah? You bet. <laughs> I'm sus. Oh, hey, I forgot to tell you. Some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the location, and then your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. Hey, sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... it's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys... One sec. <gasps> sorry, be right back. Easy enough. Collect some samples, splice some genes, feed the people. I think I can improve on this. Let's look for the best samples. There has to be a healthy looking plant around here somewhere. This one's really productive. Lots of fruit. That's perfect. This one's technically a weed, but the hardiness could be helpful. Jesus. Scan these vines. These are clearly more efficient with water. I can use that. Okay, got some great samples. Time to bring them together. I can't believe that EMF is making these GMOs open source. Profit shouldn't be part of the equation when it comes to basic human necessities. Let's see.
wait to see this grow. Dang it. If this works, these plants will be growing faster and bearing more fruit than ever. Just imagine what Feast could do with all of that. Okay, so only these two can start it. I think I figured it out. Okay. Okay, made some great new hybrid seeds for them. Just gotta get this place ready to plant the seeds. Let's optimize their water. <gasps> Probably need to pull on that valve. I just gotta patch this up. Seems to be multiple leaks lowering the water pressure. If I don't find them all, the system won't work. Just a few more to patch up. Jesus! There's not a few more. This should do it. Dr. Foster will be pleased. He doesn't need to know Spider-Man helped out. I wonder what other field projects the EMF is working on. And we're back. So, like I was saying, this new foundation run by my best friend. It's... it's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? So sorry, gotta put you on hold. Ah! Thought I'd see you guys again. Sand in my boots, in my gloves. This is a nightmare. Time to check out that crystal. Someone's watching us, Kimia. But I don't want you to worry. That's my job. Marco thought he was being watched. And who's Kimia? Hey, Sam! Are you crashing my fight or am I crashing yours? I'm crashing crime, dude!
Sweet. I gotta bounce, but I appreciate the assist. All right, but the next post-fight piece is on me. see any bad guys. Maybe Miles and Genki had it wrong. <clears throat> hey, I'm at the bridge. But there's no sign of our mysterious safari pirates. Oh, man. We were sure it was there. <sighs> Sorry about the wild goose chase. Don't sweat it. We'll find him. Uh, littering? Come on, man. Let's try that again. What in the? Uh, Arachnid, come on! Now have your boss with the main get this kind of tech. The true hunter knows how to camouflage. You could have just said I don't know. Look around. What do we have here? Maybe it'll lead me to some answers. Okay, Birdie. Take me to your nest. Gonna miss these chases when I'm in Emily May. The adrenaline. Going through the city like it's an obstacle course never gets old. Getting to do real science, though, for actual money. Oh my god, I finally did it. I have a stable career. Okay, cool it, Parker. Daydream about those fat science stacks later. Time to chase. insurance up up and you won't get away nice cloaking tech mind if I take a look under the hood Take that as a no. Oh. 
That's too close now. I wonder if I can get my suit to identify their visual frequencies. I don't see your boss around. Where's he hiding? I want to talk to him about his lifestyle choices. Now, where's your boss? Another robot. Maybe I can test something out. Okay, let's see. Sorry, Birdie. This is just as awkward for me as it is for you. There should be a... Yep. Oh, is that your home? Send this location to MJ. Maybe she can dig up some building records. Where are we going now? Hey, MJ. Did you get that location data I sent you? Yeah, it's an old food market. Owner died last year. Building sold a few weeks ago. Wait. This buyer. There's some shell company that's been acquiring property all over the city. Like, whole city blocks. I tried to do a story on them last month, but the trail dried up. Every person I was talking to just... vanished. Go make yourselves useful. Our departure is imminent. Who are these people? I want to find out. Good luck. Need to take these two out nice and quiet. And the rest of the hunters? Their blinds are all set up and communications have been linked. We're ready. What a city to hunt in. Gotta drop one of them away. Heard something. That's one. That was fast. You find something? Two things. This armed group calls themselves hunters. And they've got a lot of accents. Hmm. International mercenaries? That's what I'm thinking. Could be front page material for your article. I'm writing it up now. Thanks. Oh, and speaking of work, I accepted Harry's offer. That's fantastic. We should celebrate later after you're done with your current work. Totally. Talk soon. That's a lot of gear. It's like they're prepping for war. That's everyone. Now, what were they up to? Hello. Surveillance video from the blind I was just at. Looks like they've got others. All around the city. I'll send this to Ganky. But he could help pinpoint these. What's Craven hunting? And why? Yes, it's loaded. 
so I'll join you soon. Just make sure the beasts have the right scent. I want them hungry. You hungry too? <coughs> Dang. See you later. Aw, for me? You shouldn't have. Sturdy and flexible. Hmm. I wonder. Nice. Time to take my shiny new toy for a test drive. Surrounding bases are online. Remaining blind secured. Cloaking feels operational. Good. Beetles, talent drones, ammunition, rations. Hmm. Still. <gasps> These guys are better equipped than most armies. This Craven guy must be rich, or well connected, or both. <gasps> Against the one man who does not. You think another hunter would challenge Craven here? Only if they are fools. Look around. Craven has given us the greatest hunt of our lives in this city. We were aimless before, but here? Yeah. It truly is the land of opportunity. That it is. That's so sick. Oh, right. I can do it so quick. Where to next. Looks like this is the only way. A research lab? Aunt May was so proud of her work at Feast. Lee broke bad in a big way. I just hope that doesn't mean everything he ever touched was corrupted. Craven's studying Lee's blood. Maybe he's trying to figure out where his powers came from. Or how to get them for himself. A 
hallucinogens. Probably the worst part of Scorpion's poison. If Craven's adding this to his arsenal, ugh. that's the Tiara Apitahi. One of the rarest flowers in the world. Its extract has some pretty powerful medicinal properties. I tried to get some years ago to counteract Scorpion's poison, but couldn't afford the flights to Riotea? Guess Craven could. Were they testing their weapons on that armor? Whoa! And not a single scratch? Almost an exact replica. Must have been probing it for weaknesses. Can never be too careful with Scorpion. Wait a sec. He's definitely just hunting these dudes. some kind of hunt. Craven the Hunter. What's he hunting? Whatever it is, it definitely involves Scorpion and Lee. Mind looking into this Craven guy in the meantime and letting Miles know what's up? Already on it. Stay safe. How about this? The main Craven wears. You know the story behind it? Didn't know there was one. There was some mine outside Sav. There was a man eater who'd killed close to a hundred workers. Craven was young, in his prime, and he tracked the lion easily. Only took a few hours. Damn. But when he finally got close enough to draw his blade...
I hear you were not impressed by the Scorpion. <laughs> it's not that I wasn't impressed. Relying on hallucinogens and playing with your prey, it's just not the way I hunt. But I can still... <laughs> shot my ass You take a look at what is in his poison? Hell of a cocktail. No way Gargan made it himself. Maybe. But I never took him to be a strategic man. Spider-Man! Uh, get it! Uh, uh, Yeah! 
A lot more difficult than it should have been. I could really use some answers instead of questions right now. That looks promising. All right, Craven. What are you looking for? Wait. I get bringing Scorpion and Lee on a hunt, but Black Cat's a thief. I don't... Boss fight. Never gonna win best in show with that attitude! <laughs> Nice, doggy, kitty, robot! Those teeth are no joke! Control would show up. Fire, you fool! Uh. Uh. They're no joke! Jeez Louise. Brother, please. What were you protecting? 
Scorpion, Martin Lee, Black Cat. This Craven guy's putting together quite the team. Nerds got murk. Have a nice trip. Is this the best you can do? They said you were a killer. Imagine my disappointment. Staying true to his name. For what? En serio. My date's almost here and you're surfing the web? Ma, no one says surfing the web anymore. <sighs> Can you just please get dressed? Okay, okay. See, you got your good lipstick on. <laughs> you must really like this guy, huh? Miles? I'm sorry. Next time, I promise. I, Miles. I love you. Hardcore porn. Let's get it. Oh, wait, I gotta start using these points. Hey, so I found a base belonging to those safari pirates, or hunters as they call themselves, and learned their boss's name Craven. And he killed Scorpion, and he's got a whole hit list of supervillains. Wait, what? Does this mean Lee?
That is sick. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. How do I get that blue one? Yeah, buddy. Those don't look that cool. Nah, eh, not maybe that one, but. I'm a black and red person. This black and blue look fucking nasty. What in the. That looks hard. I thought it looked stupid. That's the OG. Your ex? Exactly. She won't listen to me if I say she's in danger. But maybe she'd listen to someone she doesn't know. If MJ reached out to you with some addresses, would you be up for taking point on this? I got you. Thanks, really. I gotta clear my oh, head for a bit, but call me if anything comes up and... We're going to find Lee Miles. I promise. <laughs> Guess I've got some time until MJ calls. What's going on in the neighborhood? Maybe I should try to find some hunter hideouts. Hunters are trying to set something up on that roof. You are not Super Q outpost team. What the? Mind if I say it tomorrow? What the fuck is going on here? What the hell? I hit block like three times. They just lit my ass up. Okay, okay, okay. about that new Emily May Foundation. Who are they? What do they do? Well, big picture, it's an Oscorp spinoff, which we don't love, I know, but the man in charge, Harry Osborne, has got a decent rep. At the very least, he hired my favorite bee scientist, AKA Spider-Man! You see other ones? Tell me where your base is! <laughs>
she What were they guarding? Come here, Birdie. Tell me a story. A map of a base. Any chance you can show me what's waiting for me there? Disable that relay, they won't be able to call for backup. Nice. So you've been to two other blinds around Harlem, huh? Better scope out the other blinds. Maybe they'll lead me to a base. Hey, Miles, I have those addresses Pete mentioned for a few of Black Cat's safe houses. Head into the first one now. Thanks for offering to do this. Pete can get kind of blindsided by Felicia. I know you're busy with your college essay. It's cool. I always have time to Spider-Man. Sounds like you're as good at work-life balance as I am. I'm scrambling to finish my Hunter story. I might save my job. But you guys, what happened to Scorpion? We and the wind. I can't focus while he's out there, MJ. Don't. Don't let it eat you up. It might be best to just focus on the task at hand. That's not all. When I face Lee, I got some new powers. They're blue and weird. Uh, I mean, I'm no expert on spider powers, but C could it be from stress? What you're going through, it it's a lot. But you're not alone. Even Pete and I, we're still figuring it all out. One thing at a time, right? We'll find him. I know. Thanks, MJ. And Miles, be careful with Felicia. You can't trust her, no matter what she says. Warn her about the hunters and get her out of the city. Understood. Let you know when I get there. This looks like it was ransacked. Perfect chance to use the AR tech Genki upgraded. 